Peace, peace, peace. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of y'all who don't know, it's your boy Vic Slain Ho. And I come back with another little story time. You know, we out here reminiscing, man. You know, memories and laughs bring people together, you know. So, this one's about, yo, this was like the most dangerous outfit in New York City at one point. You know, it's so crazy because I, I somebody like posted this on Facebook and I was just like, I was looking for some other pictures to put together, but like, it was crazy. I couldn't really like find the pictures that I was looking for. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to just use the meme, you know, get credit to the person that made the, the, the meme and stuff like that. But yo, this outfit and I didn't add the jeans because the jeans used to vary. Sometimes it used to be a little true religion jeans or sometimes antiques. I don't know if antiques was around this time. I don't even know if people was wearing antiques with, with this type of outfit. But, you know, true religion was like, yo, they was wearing the true religion jeans. I forgot what other jeans I was really kind of wearing around that time. I remember Levi's was even, like, in for a little bit around this time. But, yo, <laughs> yo, <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Like, the cane, too. Like, it's crazy because people used to stash the cane and the merm because the merm was so big. That you could, people used to put the cane on the sleeve, or they used to put the cane, they used to tuck the cane in their pants, or, or just have it like in the chest part of the coat. Yo, it used to be crazy. And then people used to be carrying the different cane. Like, I, yo, I even used to have a cane, but my cane didn't curve. Like, I had a cane that was just like the little regular piece. Like, you know, like, you know, it wasn't, y'all don't want to talk about it. It's like, it's like a T. It looked like a T. Like, the top of the cane looked like a T. It makes a T with the rest of it. So, yeah, I had a regular cane, but like, yo, this was the time, like, yo, Either you had them Ugg boots, ACG boots on, you either had A solos, you know what I'm saying, and a Murm one with the rugby's, and dudes used to have cane on them. Like, yo, it used to be crazy. Like, yo, sometimes you used to get off the train. Like, certain stops used to be crazy. You getting off the train, and it's like 20 dudes with Murms. <laughs> and the crazy thing is, is 20 dudes, matter of fact, no, 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 I'm gassing it. It would be like, it would be 20 dudes there, but it would be like, Maybe like eight dudes with merms. And the other 12, they trying to scheme on who they going to rob and take their coat. <laughs> like, it was just crazy. Like, and, or, it, or sometimes you do see like it'll be 20 dudes with merms. Like, it was crazy. Like, sometimes getting off at stops like Jackson, getting off at like at Gun Hill of the train, like, used to be mad people. Like, two, like, you know, certain train stops in the Bronx, like, you just get off the train and you see like mad dudes with mad merms on. Like, <laughs> mad merms, the Ugg boots, or ACG boots, or A solos. And it's like, you just knew it was bad blood. You just you just knew it was bad vibes. Like, and if you especially seen only a few people with merms, they were scheming. Like, they were scheming on I'm next. Like, dudes, you literally used to go out in groups. They used to go out in groups, and they used to be like, you're next. They used to call next. Like, they used to be like, you're the next merm we see is mine, bro. Like, people used to literally call next. Like, be like, yo, I got the next one. Like. Yo, it was just, yo, the Bronx was, I ain't gonna front, man, like, them, them years, yo, from, like, mid-2000s, before, like, 2010, like, I got locked up 2010, so I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it was a lot of crazier stuff going on, but them years, them, them mid-2000 years, it was, it was crazy out here, bro, it was crazy, and let me not get into the story about the gangs, like, when they had Bronx homicide, and, like, you know, Cortland, and, 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 and Ah, oh, Dub Dub City, like all these little. It was a point in time. It was so many different little cliques and different little hoods that was was had a little alliances and they was going against like yo. It was it was a crazy time in the Bronx, man. It was a crazy, crazy, crazy time in the Bronx. But that outfit, yo. And the funny thing about this outfit is like you 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 fake fly with it, like like the outfit was like you fly, <laughs> but the outfit also says. Motherfucker, I'll rob you. <laughs> like, it's crazy. Like, it, it was like, it's literally like a fly outfit. You know, nice little rugby. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, the, the Ugg boots was, was money too. The rugby was money though. The, the coat was money. But it was like, sometimes you don't even know. Like, sometimes motherfucker stole the whole outfit. <laughs> because people were taking people's shoes. But it, was, it wasn't really that big. Like, you know what I'm saying? But people was just stealing, bro. Like, they was just stealing. And it was crazy because the outfit either screamed, oh, you're a fresh dude. or And they also screamed like, he probably grind me, like, like I'll rob you. Like, you got to watch this dude. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, but it was a crazy time, though. But let me know what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe, share. And share some of y'all memories, man. Word. <laughs> y'all be safe out there. Peace.